Hey, my name is Miss Sarah and welcome to Make and Learn with Aurora Public Library. Make and Learn is a series of games and activities that you can do with your child at home to practice their early literacy skills and get your child ready to read. Today we're making a fun and easy game called Feed the Kitty or Puppy or Monster, really whatever critter you want to make it. This game is easy to make and fun to play. You'll need a few supplies. First, a paper bag, and then crayons, markers, or any writing utensil you'd like, construction paper, scissors, and glue if you want to glue any pieces on. To get started, open the paper bag and fold it the opposite way of the creases. Toward the top, cut a straight slit. And then you'll cut a curved cut meeting the end of that slit. Open your bag again and there you have your creature's mouth. Now here comes the fun part, making your creature. You can make any animal you want. A dog, bunny, guinea pig, anything you want. Or make a fictional creature too, like a monster. I'm turning mine into a cat. So I'm using my markers and construction paper to make a little kitty. Now we need to make some food for our hungry kitty. Using a piece of construction paper or cardstock, create little flashcards. Now you can write the alphabet or numbers onto the cards. You could even do sight words for slightly older kids. Using letters of the alphabet helps your child practice their letter knowledge so they can become familiar with the different letters in the English language, as well as the sounds that those letters make. Using numbers is a great way to incorporate STEAM with the math component, and they can learn to count and also do simple math equations. Our kitty is hungry for letters and numbers, so let's play. You can ask your child to feed the kitty a certain letter or make the sound a certain letter makes and ask them to identify it and feed the kitty that letter. If your child's a little older, you can have them practice spelling words like their name or other words they're familiar with by feeding the letters to the kitty. Incorporate math into the game by having your child practice their counting. Have them feed the kitty the numbers in order. For older kids, you can have them solve some simple math equations, like what's three plus six? This fun and easy game encourages print motivation because it makes learning the alphabet and practicing their letters fun, which makes kids want to learn to read. It encourages letter knowledge because they're learning their letters, learning what they sound like, what they look like as they feed their critter. And it also can encourage phonological awareness. As you're playing the game with your child, talk to them and ask them what sound each letter makes or ask them to find the letter that makes a certain sound. That way they can hear the individual sound that that letter makes and soon understand how we combine different sounds of letters to make words. Thanks so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoy this fun game. If you play it, let us know about it in the comments. Join us next time for more Make and Learn Early Literacy Fun. And in the meantime, visit our Pinterest page, pinterest.com slash auroraPublic for more early literacy ideas to make learning fun at home. Bye.